Okay, we are in a Premiere AI. Down. I want to explain AI architecture generator. It's very interesting. <clears throat> the main purpose of this AI generator, image generator, is creating such as this architectural purpose. First, you have to prompt, describe what you want. Then uh, mm, you have to see which scene do you want to. For example, <clears throat> uh, the, the scene that you are in the, your mind to better understanding, the software better understand. Let's type something. For example, this, a two, to a story, no, a building. A building with clear glass window, there is a swimming pool and plants and the background is a beautiful forest. Nice. The scene means uh, in which scene do you want to uh, close to your idea? Which scene is close to your idea? You can see we have a lot of scene, <coughs> architectural scene. For example, which scene do you want? Something like that. Yeah, something that has a pool. It's close to this my idea, and you can describe more. Perspective means the camera perspective in which direction top, for example, up, or for example, drone area, mm, such as these things, or fish islands. It's you can control camera view <coughs> with a perspective. Negative prompt. The exactly thing that you don't want to see in your scene you have to type for example you don't want to see any birds any things fast mode is on three image and generate with this prompt let's waiting to be done and nice yeah in this case we have a small swimming pool here these are my previous per, uh, try. You can see the forest at the background and the pool. Nice. <clears throat> the perspective is in this view. Uh, you can enhance your prom and let. I think. Is there anything? You can go to the customize. Customize that make it none. Let's camera, let's AI doing everything for you and let's try again. Just based on these prompts. Wow, nice. You can see these are unique images. Let's insert our prompt with no option. <clears throat> let's AI thinking about that. Just base my prompt. Don't uh, use any scene. You have to go to the customize tab and make it customize. Mean none. It means none. <clears throat> yeah, I think without any option, the AI doing its best based on prompts. Nice. Let's try another. A six unit apartment apartments with the black stone in <clears throat> walls with a large glass window is located in the side of the street with a several car just uh, several cars just doing based on the prompts not close to one of this scene and here you can change the ratio for example in this nice <clears throat> And let's see what happened. These are one by one images. The fast mode is on. <clears throat> and nice. Nice. So you see, without uh, choosing any scene and perspective, this, um, the AI itself doing best. Six unit, apartment, blackstone in the wall, inside of the street. Nice. 
if you choose the option for example the scene architectural scene and a, a lots of architect architectural scene it's trying to close your prompt to the disk but make the ai doing itself by itself and it does its jobs very well interesting and you can enhance it if you want <clears throat> changing your word six in the apartment the corner of the building is the street surrounded by towers nice let's try this <clears throat> so going to the customize tab and make it none it adds a lot of things to your prompt let's see what happened here wow nice it's surrounded by towers interesting okay i hope you enjoyed so for architectural purpose ai architectural for using promi ai go to the description and click on this link then a simple create an account you can uh, log in or sign up you can continue with your google account or you can uh, give an email and create a password if you want and here is promi ai website for using the Promi AI tools, AI tools, you have to spend coins. If you need more coins to using more of tools, you have to buy one of these plants. And you can redeem a code. I give that code in description. You can use it to get some coins. Please don't forget to visit our tutorial says apps channel. In this channel, we are introducing Android application and learn how to use them.